The fifth Iranian presidential election was held on the 28th of July, 1989. A lot happened since the last election. In 1988, the Iran-Iraq War ended in a stalemate, and in June of 1989, Supreme Leader Ruhollah Khomeini died. President Khamenei would eventually succeed him as Supreme Leader, and he is still in charge to this very day. Alongside a presidential election, amendments to the Constitution were introduced. Some of the changes including reducing the qualifications for Supreme Leader, abolishing the position of Prime Minister, and renaming Iran's Parliament. Originally, it was called the National Consultative Assembly, and now it was called the Islamic Consultative Assembly. In simple terms, a lot happened. Out of the 79 people who registered candidacies, only two of them were approved by the Guardian Council. These two candidates were Akbar Hashemi Rafsanjani and Abbas Shaybani. Rafsanjani was previously a key member of late Khomeini's inner circle, the Speaker of Parliament, Minister of Interior, among other things. Abbas Shaybani, who I mentioned in episode 3 of the series, decided to take another go for the presidency. And here are the results. Akbar Rafsanjani won, with 94% of the vote while Abbas Shaybani won 3%. 54% of those eligible voted in this election. 